Ashley from Ashley's Got Book Excitement, and I'm here with Friday Reads. Yay! So, this week, for those of you that are out of the loop, maybe, I don't know, uh, it's the Battle Books Readathon week, and although I am not officially participating, I have been reading like the readathon has been important to me. Now, I'm not one of those people that has, like, finished five books because I can't do that. But, um, I did finish The Girl in the Clockwork Collar. Uh, that one's good. So this, this Friday, I've moved on to The Walking Dead, The Road to Woodbury. This is the second book in this Walking Dead Origins trilogy kind of thing, um, where we learn more about the governor and stuff like that. And this one deals with a girl named Lily, and I think she makes her way into Woodbury, and she doesn't like how the governor runs things or something like that. I'm not sure. So I am on page, I think it's 50, 55. I got my, um, I got my zombie. He's marking my spot. I think I'm going to call him Zeke. What do you guys think? What's a good zombie name? Uh, I thought Zeke maybe, and then that's all I got. But if you guys got better ones, tell me. And after I finish this one, I think I'm going to move on to a Kindle book. I don't have a picture because they don't provide me with a picture. What's a picture of this? Oh. Um, and it's The Girl with the Iron Touch by Katie Cross. Uh, that one I got from NetGalley for review. I was pretty excited. That one's pretty popular. And it's the third book in the Steampunk Chronicles series. I don't know how many there are. So those are my weekend reading plans. What are your weekend reading plans? Tell me if you're participating in the readathon and how you're doing. And yeah, that's all I got. I'll see you guys later. Buh bye bye